The final score, Pembroke Hill 1, Scion 0. Well, that we swapped senior day victories because oh, yeah. they beat yeah, us on their senior day. That's right. Welcome to Senior Night, a special evening as we gather to celebrate the dedication, skill, and heart of our senior field hockey players. Today we honor these athletes and their parents for their years of hard work, commitment, and leadership on and off the field. Join us in recognizing their outstanding contributions. Tessa Lambright. Start at 25, Tessa Lambright, daughter of Amanda and Kirk Lambright has been a driving force in our field hockey team throughout her high school journey. As our steadfast captain, she's defended the goal with unwavering determination for all four years. Tessa's passion for field hockey extends beyond high school as she's committed to play Division I field hockey at Hofstra University. <laughs> Tessa's leadership shines as a link through leader and her commitment to community service is evident through her involvement in clubs such as Women's Student Union, Pep Club, and International Club. Kate Ellis. Kate Ellis, proudly donning the number 23 jersey, dominates in the left forward position. Accompanied by her mom, Catherine Ellis, she exemplifies excellence both on and off the field. Kate's commitment to academics is evident through her inclusion in the National Field Hockey Academic Squad and her consistent presence on the honor roll. Beyond field hockey, she ventured into soccer for a year and served as the girls lacrosse manager for two years. Her leadership extends into extracurriculars as the head of link crew, a member of Madrigals, and vice president of the French club. Caroline Copaker. Caroline's being escorted by John and Shelley Copaker. She leads by example as captain of the field hockey team, wearing the number four jersey and showcasing her talents in the midfield. Her dedication is unparalleled, having excelled in field hockey, basketball, girls swim and dive, and soccer throughout her upper school career. Beyond sports, Caroline's leadership extends to her roles as the secretary of the medical club and participation in the Madrigals and Spanish Club, and also serving as a campus guide. Academically, Caroline is on the high honor roll, and her commitment to excellence earned her the title of an AP Scholar with distinction. Layla Howe. Layla, proudly wearing the number two jersey, is joined by her mother, Jessica Wakefield. In celebrating, her accomplishment, in celebrating her accomplishments. Beyond her standout role on the field hockey team as a defender, Layla has also explored other avenues of athleticism, participating in the winter cheer team, dance team, soccer, and track during her upper school years. Her leadership shines through as president of the East Asian Club and vice president of the Multicultural Student Union. Layla's academic dedication is evident through her presence on the high honor roll and her membership in the Cum Laude Society, 
while her passion for writing and editing is showcased as a writer and editor for The Voice. May Marion McManus. May, a formidable defensive force in our field hockey team, proudly wears the number 17 jersey. She's being escorted by her mom, Jenny Marion. Maeve's dedication extends beyond the field as she's played soccer for two years and actively contributes to the Social Justice Club. An avid writer and editor, Maeve serves as the senior editor for the Garrett and also writes for The Voice. Her academic prowess is evident through her consistent presence on the honor roll and her commitment to excellence has earned her the prestigious Smith Book Award and Princeton Book Award. Maeve's journey is one of both athletic and intellectual distinction. Gretchen Schumacher. Gretchen is the daughter of Chris and Kelly Schumacher. She's a dedicated defender on the field hockey team, proudly donning the number eight jersey. In addition to her commitment to field hockey, she showcased her athleticism on the track team for three years. Gretchen's passion for service and leadership is evident through her role as vice president of the Community Service Club and her participation in the mock trial team. Her academic excellence consistently lands her on the high honor roll, reflecting her well-rounded dedication to both sports and education. Gretchen's journey is one of achievement, teamwork, and community involvement. <laughs> Isabel Bernstein. <laughs> Isabel's being escorted by her parents, Steve Bernstein and Cindy Flick. She's a standout on the field hockey field as a varsity right forward, proudly bearing jersey number 40. In addition to her field hockey prowess, Isabel played lacrosse during her freshman and sophomore years. Her academic achievements are exceptional, consistently earning her a place on the high honor roll. Beyond the classroom and the sports field, Isabel's commitment to service shines through with her receipt of the Bartlett Cup and the Gold Presidential Service Award. Her journey is marked by excellence in both athletics and academics, as well as a strong dedication to giving back to her community. Yeah. Anna Whalen. Yeah. Anna's being accompanied by her parents, Beth and Pat Whalen. She's been a pivotal presence on our field hockey team, skillfully commanding the midfield and proudly wearing number 12. Anna's devotion to the sport is unyielding, evidenced by her role as the 2023 season captain and her well-deserved spot on the National Field Hockey Academic Squad. She has also excelled in girls lacrosse for three years. Beyond athletics, Anna is a valued link crew member and campus guide, contributing her energy to the pep club, Spanish club, and cooking club. Her unwavering dedication to academic excellence is highlighted by her frequent appearances on the high honor roll establishing her as a true all-around leader. Please join me in applause one more time to recognize the class of 2024 Raider Field Hockey senior team members and their parents. Cute. In the handicap spot, you can see it. 